What is up, everybody, and welcome to uh, Nerd is the New Sexy Let's Play video. I am MySchool960, and I'm going to be taking you on a journey. A journey that I find nostalgic, in a sense. It is one of my favorite, you know, favorite of all RPGs. It's what started me on an RPG, and that is Shining Force. Let's go ahead and put it in, and let's play. Ages long forgotten. Light fought darkness for the control of the world. Dark dragon led the evil hordes of darkness. The ancients fought back with the powers of light. In my opinion, the text is a little bit too slow. But Dark Dragon was defeated and cast into another dimension. I believe I can fix the text once we get into it. The Lord of Darkness vowed to return in 1,000 years. Time passed and Dark Dragon was forgotten by all. Ten centuries of peace ruled the land of Rune. Until the kingdom of Runefoss brought war and fear to Rune. Hordes of evil creatures ravaged every land. Here and there, strongholds of good still held out. awaiting a hero who could wield the powers of light. Shining Force, a legacy of great intention. So there is a Shining Force before the Shining Force, which is called... Um... Into the Shining Force or something. But there, there's a prequel to this. But I'm starting with this because it's my favorite. Wow, Dark Dragon, Ancients. Let's see now. What else does this book, old book say? 1,000 years have passed since they vanquished Dark Dragon. And this book says Dark Dragon threatened to return right about now. I bet anything that Dark Dragon's behind the evil hordes of Runefost. I need to tell someone about this, but who would listen to a kid like me? I think Dark Dragon's coming back. Will you help us? Come on, it'll be an adventure. Good enough. Let's go on with your adventure. Oh, I have to press the right button. Pick an adventure. Say, what shall I call you? Well, let's go ahead and call me Ice Cold, because I am cold as ice. Nice to meet you, Ice Cold. I'm Simone. Come back often and tell me everything. You need to get going. Evil spreads far across the rune with every passing day. Chapter 1 Rune Foss Invasion. Come on, kid, wake up. I didn't hit you that hard. Keep your guard up, kid. The beasts of Rune Foss will tear you to pieces. That's enough for today. You need to take it easy for a while. Well, I school had enough to play for a day. I don't know how you keep at it hour after hour. I'm dead tired after about 15 minutes. You have the makings of a great fire, I school. You'll be tested soon enough. Lord Varus, the king has sent for you. You must come at once. Of course, lead the way, guardsmen. Fear the worst, Ice Cold. Prepare yourself for true battle immediately. Did you see Ferris' face? He went pale. Something really big is happening. Let's split up and see if we can't find out what's going on. I'll see you later. 
All right, so now here's where we get free rain, sort of. I'm going to try to get... So as you adventure through this game, you can get various people on your side. Hey there, youngster. My name is Gore. Care to hear my story? No one talks to me anymore. All too busy. Want to hear a secret? Never trust anyone outside the city. Murderers and thieves. All of them. Ought to know. I used to be a great warrior. Been all over the world. Well, I have half a mind to go out again. Would if I got a good offer. Okay. Oh. Let's push this cart. Hey, watch it, pal. How'd you like it if I tried to run you over the cart? Sorry, but I'm busy packing. Grandpa's out somewhere. He has time to talk. Grandpa was once the best warrior all of Rune, but that was a long time ago. So, Gort is her grandpa. Oh, come on, doggy. All right, so let's go up to the castle. They all look similar. That is the story, Varius. Hmm, then your majesty. Majesty. We have no choice but to send Ice Cold, a young fighter. Oh, Ice Cold, good. I was going to look for you. First, listen to the king. centuries our people have watched the gate of the ancients as its guardians beyond that gate lies we know not what not even if it is uh, uh not even if it is of light or darkness but the ancients knew and they sealed it beyond the gate and set us as guards now we find that we may have failed in our mission or reason for existence signs have been seen that forces of runefast are at the gate of the ancients Whatever evil they are planning, we must stop it at all costs and at once. But we must not panic the people. A small group of young but skilled warriors. Yes, he could do it. He could leave town unnoticed and have a chance to succeed, perhaps. Yes, Nova, I agree. Will you take this task? Sure. You now return to town and gather your troops. Come back when you're ready. Okay. So I literally just have to leave and go back. Because then my friends, Nova sent us, we're going with you, I'm Luke the Warrior, Ken the Knight, at your service, I'll fire you wherever you leave. I'm Tao, I'm only a prince mage, but I'll do my best, and I'm Hans, an elven archer, I'm coming, but don't put me in front lines, oh you're going to the front lines Hans, you, you definitely are, I'm not really putting him there, <laughs> Miz at headquarters in the castle. Don't try to sneak out of town without me. And there's Luke, uh, the healer. Now you have your comrades return to the king and hear his final commands. Follow your progress, yada yada. So Nova is like an advisor to the Shining Force. You have your troops, but you need supplies. Take this, purchase what you need. 100 coins. You should give me King's Ransom, why don't you? The cart will take you to the Gate of the Ancients. Go now and carry out your task. Nothing I could buy for equipment wise. But I can definitely buy some herbs. Can never have too many. I'm trying to somewhat stock up for the future because 
each battle in of its sense does have RNG to it. So even if I do everything I can, I could be screwed. Goblins, Dreamfrost must be up to something. So, remember when I said always look around to see um, possible people for joining you? Gort isn't here with us this time. He will be, though. But, actually, I'll go ahead and just spam this. Get her out of the way. Wait for my character's turn. Do you really want to retreat from this battle? Yes. So I want to go over here. Oh, there you are. I'm gone. I've fought the evil roof off for many years. I will aid you. And there you go. Instantly, another helping hand. No one's in that direction. Green things are in the woods. They gave me what? Oh, they gave me the creeps. Well, what surprise really to have guests in such a remote area. I am a friar alone. I look at how may I help you? And I don't need your help right now. Greetings, I was told I've been waiting for you. So that little guy is named Yogurt. And I still, to this day, cannot remember how the hell to get him, but he he's kind of useless, but he's fun to have. All right, so let's go back to this fight. There, now we have a helping hand. points of damage so for fighting there's a chance for you to get double damn you know to attack twice there's a chance for you to get a crit you can even crit on, while attacking twice or on very rare occasions three times you can also if you're being attacked you can counterattack, but it just means that the enemy when you attack them they can counterattack. And in boss fights like, or not boss fights per se, in fights just like this, you see where he did double attack. Um, if you go after the boss of the area, which is that night in the very northern part, this guy right here, the Renite, you will the fight would be over and you win. And it's not like that for everyone, but. It, there's a lot of you know, I'm not gonna waste magic you have one health so after every attack you do you gain XP after every kill you do you gain XP let's go over here The higher hit, the more XP you get. But if you're way out leveled, if you're way out leveling the opponent, your enemies, you'll get minimal XP, no matter how hard you hit. It's the way that the game balances itself. Now here, I will cast Blades, just, just to kill this one faster.
and every every level you need 99 basically 100 xp to level up but as i said before the more you go up you know the difference that your level is versus your opponent level the less experience you can get or more if the character you're fighting has more is more of a higher level than you are you'll get more xp Lo, not Luke. I don't know why. There is a character named Luke, but Lo is that guy's name. There we go, double tech. Typically, one of my guys levels up. This is rare for me to go through. Uh. First fight was all level one. Usually it's like Ken or Tau. Speaking of which, I need to level up, or not level, heal. Put you there. Item, use. Because there's an achievement I'm also trying to go for. Which is um, not to lose anyone either in this fight or the next fight. I can't remember. Oh, thank God he didn't double. have uh, Gong go finish this dwarf. It doesn't look like a dwarf though. The dwarf's supposed to be like a bit smaller. That was a freaking giant. So even when Gorg, uh, Gorg, or not Gorg, Gong uses no weapons, he does a lot of damage. how hard he hits. So, Gong can heal too. I will... Uh, I will heal Ice. I was thinking of going for that Dwarf, but healing is more important right now. Because if Ice dies, that's game over. You're going to start the fight all over. Uh, you'll spawn back at the Friar and it's annoying. So with him being your commander, you really shouldn't put him on the front lines like I am. But he also, down further down the line, you want him to be the highest level he can be. There, see, so Tau's level 2 now. Uh, maximum magic points by 2. Go ahead and try to kill this dark dwarf. There we go, now he's up. Level 2. 
attack by one, defense by one, and speed by one. And here it is, the end of part one of the Shining Force Let's Play here at Nerds New Sexy. Hope you guys enjoyed, and as always, stay nerdy and stay sexy, always.